Putsa ko na na ako ni Ron! Magsago na ang klase! Kabulo na ko! Mungutan ako sa mga classmates! Mm, saon man ato ni klase, uy! Bitaw, sa mukha ng COVID, uy, di na noon ko kita guwapo. Guys, guwapa kay ko, no? Di, obvious man, no? Dai, ay kabalaka, naray tutorial game mong stack para ani. Hey there, Stection! Welcome to the world of Google Meet, where the magic of learning begins. For this school year, we only have one requirement for each Stection, and that is your Gmail account. That Gmail account would be used to log in and see your respective Google Meet and Google Classroom created by your respective subject teachers. Google Meet allows us to have real-time discussions like we are in a regular classroom. And since this will be our new classroom for this so-called new normal, let's start learning its corners, shall we? At the bottom center, we will find three buttons. Let's label button number one as microphone, button number two as call, and button number three as camera. As the name suggests, pressing the microphone button enables the microphone of your phone or laptop. When its color is red, your microphone is off. If it's color white, then your microphone is on. The same logic applies to the camera. Keep in mind that you would want both of these off unless the teacher tells you to answer a question or requires you to do so. The second button or the call button ends the meeting or exits you from the discussion. So never press this button unless class has ended. Okay? Now, let's take a look at the two options by the upper right corner. The first button allows you to see all the class participants, or in other terms, your classmates. Next, we have the chat box. This allows you to send a message or ask questions during discussions without interrupting your teacher. We're almost through, we just need to get over these two options, and we're done! At the bottom right corner, we have another set of options. The first option enables captions during discussions. This would be greatly beneficial to those with hearing problems or to those having difficulties catching up, especially if the instructor talks too fast. The Present Now button gives you the ability to present or display your screen. Pressing this would open another batch of options. Choose your entire screen and you are now ready for reporting. Nani? Nani? MJ, you're not going to say man. Hello, Bito. Bye, guys. What's up guys, Gina Rabaya here, and kay bado mo mo kung saan pag access in yung Google Classroom? Well that's simple! All you have to do is to follow these simple steps. First, access Google Classroom through your Gmail account. Then, locate and click the 9 bullets icon. Locate and click Google Classroom from there. You can also access Google Classroom by searching for classroom.google.com in the search bar. Then enter the Gmail account you are using. Get the class code from your subject teacher and join the classroom. Oh, diba? Simple! Inside the classroom, there are three sections. Stream, Classwork, and People. In Stream, this is where you can share something with your class like saying, Good morning, sir! Or any other messages or comments you'd like to share to your class. In Classwork, this is where you will find the modules for you and also the tasks and quizzes that you will be given to answer. To answer the task given, simply click on it, open it with Google Docs, download it in Microsoft Word, and then you simply answer it and save it. You then submit it by viewing your work, view the details of the task, add your finished work there, and click Mark as Done. Meanwhile, the quizzes will be given as a Google form. Simply click on it, answer it, and submit. The teachers will provide modules for the students to study. The materials for the modules will be given as document files, PowerPoint presentations, and or YouTube videos. Just click on the module and you will find the materials there. In People, this is where you can see the list of your classmates and your teacher. 
You can check your scores and progress by going to Classwork and then clicking View Your Work. Just wait for the teacher to grade your work and do as told to see your score. And that is it! You are now ready for classes and fully equipped for the school year 2020-2021. See y'all again, sections! Uh, I'm not ready now. Ready na po to learn in the new normal. Car, paghugas na! It's like a few days I work from home.